This is a question I got about the Adirondack chairs with heavier humans. So this is an Adirondack chair made out of a wine barrel. It's definitely sun faded, whatever. Um, so a lot of the weight ends up on this board right here. So the very back and all of the weight shoves into that board right there. Now this chair is actually pretty sturdy, but I mean, if you were to start play with it, I mean, you know, stand on it, push on it. So those are the most common stress points right there and right there. So I had a guy last year um, tell me that he was about 450 pounds. So he was, you know, a bigger guy and he was hoping to have a more reinforced chair. And so this is what I came up with. So just half of a stave and then just tuck it right there and then just cut it so that it fits behind that board. Take your pencil, hold it in place, get it right up here. And so I've just marked it. So this is the best solution I've been able to come up with. And it, I feel it works very well. This is oh, it's so much sturdier. Here we go, here we go. So now when someone sits in this chair, it's gonna put the weight here and it's gonna push it back to there. Another potential solution for a heavier sitter is to make a rocking chair. So choose some boards for runners. It doesn't take much to just um, tie the rocker on the front and the back, but then what happens is when they sit, first off, it sits higher up off the ground, but then all of the weight ends up going back there. Thank you for the question. I hope that helped.